boy Cash, and this is boy Cash Team Tate, and you rocking with Smooth Talk TV. You did one set. I appreciate you, my boy. Appreciate you, man. I appreciate you for being here, bro. What's up? Man, I just want to tell you, you that. Appreciate you for having me, bro. What's up? Man, I appreciate you, man. So let's get straight into it, man. So we just gonna start off your um, where you from, man? Just let everybody know where you from. Yo, I'm from um the real west, but it's it's a um section in the Grand Georgia. But I'm from the west side of the Grand Georgia, but we call it real west though. So. For sure, for sure. So what part of side of uh, La Grand you from? Uh, I'm from the west side of La Grand. I'm from the um I'm from the hillside Bellline area of La Grand. It's on the west southwest side of La Grand, and um nice little area. I mean, it wasn't like, it just wasn't like they were getting shot every day type shit, but shit was going on, you know what I'm saying? You feel <laughs> facts, shit facts. was going on. Facts. So, like, just uh, describe how it's like growing up there. Uh, well, I like, I like to describe it as it's a perfect blend of city and country. And what I mean by that is, like, a lot of our shit, a lot of shit we do, we do it, like, everything, like, LaGrange is heavily influenced by Atlanta. You feel what I'm saying? Atlanta ain't nothing but an hour away from the grain. So like a lot of shit, Atlanta will be on nine times out of ten, the grain gonna probably do that shit too. Like we still got like our own like lingo and shit. Like cause I don't, we don't use shit that I still ain't heard people use. Like we got we got a saying called knock loose. I ain't still haven't heard nobody use that shit. So what's that mean? It just mean like it just means like some lame shit. Like it all depends on how you use it, bro. Like, okay, like that's what I'm trying to talk to a girl, right? But you spilled some on my shirt while I trying to talk to a girl. You did some knock loose ass shit. Uh -huh, you know okay, what I'm saying? Okay, you knocked me loose, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> that shit was not loose, you know what I'm saying? So it basically means like you, you fucked up or you did some lame ass shit or, or a situation with lame. Like, I felt my I felt my tech, man. That's not loose ass shit. Like, I mean, it's some lame shit type shit. I feel that, I feel But for the most part, we just, like, we, we got our city, like, our city part ain't big in the grain. We got more rural area than we got city. But, like, the city part is, like, you know what I'm saying? That shit, you know, it, it, it's, it's some shit, like, you gotta be careful in the grain. I ain't gonna cut too, like, no cap for real, like. I already know, man. I already know, man. <laughs> so, like, um, so how was, like, um, so as you was growing up, and stuff like that. What 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 sports did you was you playing in? Like what sport did you get Bro, into? I played I played football, I played basketball, I wrestled, and I did track. But track and last you know, I was good at wrestling, I just didn't fuck with it. Like I didn't have no passion for it. Mm. You feel me? But I was good at it, but I wanted to play basketball, but I really wasn't that good at basketball. So, you know, but I love football. Like football was my first love, like when I saw Michael Vick play, it was over with. Even though I was a fat nigga, I felt like I could do anything Michael Vick could do, my nigga. If chop shot Michael Vick, if it wasn't for Michael Vick, I probably wouldn't have picked up a football, bro. On my mom, shout out to Michael Vick. I feel that, I feel that. So like, um, how did like, how did you use football to like, to help your situation? Um, Cause, like growing up, like, being like, being a chubby kid and just like, being like, in a situation I was, I didn't really have a lot, like, my folk literally did the best they could. Like, then again, I ain't saying like, like I didn't go without eating. I didn't go without like having shit. Just like, like when it came like the financial wise, they did the bare minimum because they only could do the bare minimum. But you know what I'm saying? I still had a good life. You know, like I would have loved them now. But when it comes to like having shit and to, you know, having shit, the other kid got like, I mean, like, I say like, like elementary school to my like seventh grade year. Like, I get one pair of shoes for school, and I had to make them just lad the whole school year. Like, that type of shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I, I had to, like, get a pair of forces. Them bitches got to lad the whole school year, bro. Because I wasn't going to get another pair of shoes until, like, that time to go to school again the next year. So, I mean, it was straight, though, bro. Like, I enjoyed the shit. So, like, but, like, football wise, like, that shit just gave me an outlet. You know, it just gave me an outlet, like, to, like, let my stress go up. If I was feeling bad that day, I could take it out on somebody at practice. You know what I'm saying? Like, it just was a way to, like, to relieve the stress type shit. Okay, okay, okay. So far, like... Yeah, see music painting drugs, but it wasn't no love. Yeah, daddy was a thug, mama on them drugs Grandma did what she could just for all of us Granddaddy what he could to keep the bills up I been thugging in these streets trying to make it by Yeah, couldn't get around, had to ask for rise Getting high off the weed, so the 